assalamu alaikum friends so welcome to our part theory so this is very main and important part regarding free rolling and wiring so once we are going to do the wiring inside the junction box panel or any kind of uh, you can say panel transformer or anything so during the entry side inside the junction box are regarding on the cores what type of free rolls we are using so let's start identification of cable shall include the cable number and destination so as discussed in the video uh, first one uh, on the whiteboard you see that one outside the cable which ss stainless steel tag with the cable ties we are using so in the second line same and there should be a cable number which one mentioned in the cable schedule okay once cable enter in the junction box provide pvc tag with cable number so same once the cable enter inside the junction box we have to provide the pvc uh, like a pvc sleeve type tag but it can uh, tie with uh, like cable ties pvc cable ties we can use that one and there is also the number okay after that once the cable uh, the cores individual cores it's three four five whatever and where we have to connect then we will go to the wiring diagram so i attach one some uh, in the below one drawing and there you can read that one okay each uh, core cable shall have a pvc heat shearing cable tube with the free roll scheme so we will discuss the scheme later but uh, inside like uh, some we can say RTU panel in instrument or in the transmitters the standard uh, it's recommended that one we have also clear PVC sleeve upside the fee roll after written then we have a shrinkable PVC sleeve then we can heat it so the open the termination we are going to sometime open connecting again and again then the color on the tube sometime it will be damaged so the, if there is a pvc sleeve that numbers cannot be like a damage removable the scheme is from two this is a very common question sometime in interviews they ask okay what is the scheme of free rolling what is the uh, how you prepare the free roll so main thing is from two we have to mention on the free rolls cable coming from where and connecting with terminal block or terminal numbers wires at termination point shall be identified by the use of permanently imprinted or embossed so this is the uh, again maintain creepage distance in electrical uh, like a 25 mm per kv enclosures inside the junction box and 40 mm per kv outside that one in electrical make sure the color coding phase neutral or ground this is very uh, common question you have to make sure for phase coloring and grounding color or others and in electrical for lighting or inside the breaker there is no need like a free roll scheme if like we are going to connect the wire inside the lighting uh, box or some only for breaker then we can follow the scheme abc or red yellow below just by the identification of color codes of that face okay here we are here now you can see in this drawing so from the right side you can see the terminal block number one it's inside the junction box and we are there is a black white cable is connecting and this cable is going to some mov okay and outside you can see the uh, 664 ic 0003 that is a cable number so this cable number is outside the junction box okay now here we go to the pair one in right side please uh, focus on that okay it's coming from where it's coming from 664 mov 001 it's coming from some mov and it's connecting where connecting to the tb1-1 this is the you can see the tb and you can see that one here is the tb and the cable is connecting to the number one 
so it's already inside the junction box that's why here no need to write the junction box number okay same here if you see the second uh, cable uh, like a black coming from rear and it's connecting here this is ferrule scheme if you see and if we will go to this side then it is just like a opposite okay if you see it's coming from tb1 jb then there is a jb number we have to mention the jb number and it's connecting where it's connecting to the black point of if you can zoom out uh, it's more clear for you but uh, i think it's okay uh, everyone can read so this is the ferrule scheme i think it's very clear for you now uh, easy to understand that one and uh, here is like uh, one more if you can see that one uh, red white and there is a ground cable and it's connecting it's like coming from you can see here two core plus one is ground this a uh, this is a cable number this is uh, on the ss stainless steel tag and here individual core we have to prepare like that okay jb uh, dash 010 it's coming from where and it's connecting to jb 001 x1 this is the x terminal number and here is the block number so you get it and where we have to make the fee roll half mean where it's reached to half point one is and then point two so when you are going to make half should be slash not dash dash is here different if you can see where the ferrule become half should be slash we have to use a slash slash mean the uh, one side ferrule is completed and now you are going to start an other side this is also common mistake during the construction they make it dash so it, it's not uh, correct should be hash so this is the our wiring ferrules very uh, i think uh, everyone understand very well and if still have uh, some question or if you have uh, some any issue please write in comment okay so we can discuss more regarding that uh, but i think related to wiring now this topic is closed so we will move on for next uh, our other remaining topic and soon i will try to start also on the instrument uh, standards uh, like prepare some more videos okay thank you guys assalamu alaikum